Sports Cast. There is also new concern tonight surrounding the nuclear power plant near Fort Calhoun. And that's because the inflatable berm around the plant collapsed early this morning, and Lauren Squires is there tonight. This is Lauren Squires, and I'm outside the Fort Calhoun nuclear power plant where the U.S. Nuclear Regulatory Commission is monitoring some things that happened overnight. At 125 this morning, a 2,000-foot-long water-filled berm providing supplemental support to the plant collapsed. Now, this allowed floodwaters to surround the auxiliary and containment buildings, which are protected by floodwaters with a level up to 1,014 mean sea level. Now, according to this press release, the Missouri River is currently at 1,006.3 feet, and river levels are not expected to exceed 1,008 feet. Now, we're going to bring you the latest coming up. We'll talk with people living by, but again, officials here say the power plant is not threatened by that collapse. In Fort Calhoun, Lauren Squires, Channel 6 News. And the NRC chairman, Gregory Jasko, will visit the Fort Calhoun nuclear plant tomorrow. Today, he is touring the Cooper nuclear plant at Brownville. We'll share his thoughts on that situation tonight at 10.